Hello guys, welcome back to my page. It's WhiteFang34 bringing you tips for Assassin's Creed Revelations. Well, it's been a while, sorry about that, but I've had a lot to get to. Today we're going to be covering money making. You see these gentlemen? They're thieves. They will pretty much rob anybody. This is pretty much very useful for when you walk into really large crowds and you can't pickpocket everybody yourself. They'll pickpocket guards, they'll pickpocket anyone, they'll get into fights with anyone. So they're very useful and when you pickpocket people in these games they fight back. So you hit them once or you counter them, they're either knocked out or they'll run away. So it's pretty useful to go into really, really crowded places like the bazaar and just walk in with a few sets of thieves to start pickpocketing people just to make a little bit of money. So yeah. Pickpocketing's good and all, but some people like to go treasure hunting and get a little chest which make a little bit of money also. Now depending on where you are in the game you'll have unlocked the bookstore which sells maps and when they sell maps they allow you to see icons such as the treasure map icon. You see all these treasures? These are just chests waiting to be looted. I actually went through one game and just started looting chests on this left side and they're all gone now and I made a nice little bit of money. So you go to these little icons right here you can grab a chest you'll get maybe an ingredient maybe a couple thousand dollars depending on where you are in the game and that's pretty much it for chests now missions are also another great way to make them make money I've already done all my missions so there's nothing left for me to do unless I want to go redo missions but I don't think that actually makes you money so once you start the game you'll make a little bit of money for every mission depending on what it is, side missions, it doesn't matter what kind of mission it is, as long as it's some sort of mission, side missions, um, main quest missions, they'll all make you money. So the next thing to talk about would be bank deposits. The bank icon is this little one right here. It looks like a little, um, anybody ever seen a court building? Kind of looks like that, which is ironic because it's a bank, not a court. So you walk off to those, they'll deposit money every 20 minutes. Really useful, makes it a lot of money. The way to increase this amount of money you make is to buy shops around the entire area or landmarks. And they'll give you a certain amount of money per tw every 20 minutes. I just made, I think that's a 36 grand. Yep, 36 grand. And all I did was withdraw it from the bank. Now the bank only has a certain amount it can hold, but every time you unlock a bank it increases the amount of money it can hold in its vault by a, around 5,000. And there's my thieves guys again. Now the thieves, here's a little thing I missed, when you fight guards and you kill the guards off, they'll actually loot the guards for you. This is what's called thief looting, it's an achievement, I haven't gotten it actually yet because I'm too lazy to go around fight guards with thieves since they're so weak and sometimes they're stupid enough not to even touch the guard. Well the last way to make um, money is through sending your assassins on missions. Depending on the mission and the difficulty how, how many assassins you send out to complete the mission that will make you money. So the missions themselves have a set money type and nothing else will affect it other than the success of the mission. If you succeed the mission you'll get that much money. When you when you reclaim the city like I showed you in one of my other tip videos, I believe it was the recent one or the one before this, I don't really actually remember, it's been a while uh, my second video, right, <laughs> about the assassins once you reclaim the city, they'll send you ingredients and money every 20 minutes or so there's a lot more money they send you than ingredients so much more useful in the money aspect than the ingredients and those are pretty much the main basic ways to make money. Now, I know you guys probably are annoyed at the fact that my um, audio is all messed up and it's got that really whooshing sound or whatever, but soon that's about to change. Since Christmas, I'll be able to get a little more better recording gear. I'll be able to record the audio of the game and my voice at the same time, so look forward to that. And I actually kind of need your guys' help. I'm running out of things to actually talk about. If you want more tips, just come ask me a question. I'll dedicate a video just to 
your tips. Well, actually, I'll do that a lot more often than you think. I will take a whole bunch of comments from you guys and visit and then put up um, a bunch of tip videos for you guys. So s help me out here. I've actually gotten one subscri subscriber and shout out to him. Let's see his name. The Rice Master. Nice guy. Really great. He told me my videos were awesome. So proud of myself. Yes, I have an inflated ego now. Ha <laughs> Yes, I'm awesome. So, yeah, guys. Just give me some t heads up. Ask what you want. I'm also thinking about making an Assassin's Creed walkthrough video. If you've never heard of those, it's basically a video where you go through the entire main game. So I'll restart my game and start and work my way up through the ranks, making money, recruiting assassins, all that shindigs. And another little thing I missed. At the very beginning of the game, once you start recruiting assassins, go and take out all the towers, all the Borgia towers, and get as many assassins as you can recruit. It saves your ass. You can make a lot of money through sending them out on missions at the very, very start of the game, and it'll help a lot. So... Remember guys, reviews, comments, they're really, 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 at this stage of my development as a commentator, useful. So, I'll see you guys after Christmas, happy holidays, and that's all I can say. This is White Fang.